mother of salvation for priests. To remain true to the church of my son on earth you must be prepared to feed his flock. Monday, September 23, 2013 at 1.30 p.m. My child, many signs will be made known from the heavens, upon the roofs of my son's churches, when the final changes are made in the liturgy of the Holy Mass. All those who keep their eyes open and their ears alert will witness the anger of my son in a way in which they cannot fail to notice. My son promised that he would make known his anger when they, within his church on earth, crucify him again by defiling his body and blood during the holy sacrifice of the Mass. Thunder and lightning, followed by great storms, will sweep people off their feet. More floods will be witnessed, when the sins of man will be swept away as they begin to see punishments from God, which will pour down upon humanity. Slaves to sin, even those who love my son and who remain loyal to the Holy Mass, and so they will not know the difference when the abomination is presented. Remember, it is to commemorate the death of my son that the Holy Mass is said and where the true presence of my son is made known. Soon, they will not acknowledge the truth and the new Mass will become a pagan ceremony. That day is still to come and it will happen suddenly and unexpectedly, so fast will the false prophet move. Now is the time for preparation. All those sacred servants, who are to remain loyal to the Most Holy Eucharist and who will adhere to the Holy Word of God, must begin their preparations now. To remain true to the Church of my Son on earth, you must be prepared to feed his flock with the food of life, that is his Holy Eucharist. This is the vow you made to Jesus Christ when you said you would serve him and provide his body and blood, through the Holy Mass, to all those who seek salvation. This vow must be honored until the last day. Do not fear the times ahead, when the enemies of God will try to use his holy name to condone sin and make it acceptable to all, when they will deprive all of his body and blood. This will not matter if you continue to serve my son in whatever way you can. Go in peace in the hope that all of you who love my son will be blessed with the gift of the Holy Spirit, so that you will be able to discern the truth. Your Blessed Mother. Mother of Salvation.